As we're heading out this morning, you may be noticing still a little bit of that haze that is looming. So the skies look just a little bit more filtered yet again today. As we get towards later on tonight, a cold front swings through. That will really clear the air, but also could produce a spot shower or two. Thinking after sunset this evening. And speaking of showers, we're tracking some rain chances for this upcoming holiday weekend. We're not tracking any washouts. However, we are going to be tracking some rain showers. And it looks like later on Saturday night and then also some spotty showers Sunday and Monday. Again, not complete washouts by any means for any of those outdoor plans you may have for this upcoming holiday weekend. Temperatures out there right now. We're into the 40s and 50s. Currently 57 in D.C. 50 in Frederick. We're 54 in Hagerstown. We're upper 40s. Martinsburg, low 40s, though, over towards Woodstock. And that's still one of the cooler spots on the map right now. One of the warmer spots is 60 currently in Lexington Park. We have a few clouds, mainly south of D.C. at this hour. But we're watching this cold front off towards our north. It's about to push into the northwestern corner of Pennsylvania. And that will continue to slide its way southbound and move into our area later on this evening. As I mentioned before, thinking closer to or a little bit after sunset and reminder sunset around this time of the year is a little bit after 8 p.m. So future cast showing us by 3 p.m. A few of those clouds starting to build up mainly along and north and west of I-81, but we're going to be seeing some sunny breaks closer towards the district where temperatures will be warming up right around 80 this afternoon. Then that cold front starts to push in just behind that cold front. A few of those spotty showers start to pop up into our northern zones. And then as that cold front continues to dive its way southbound, those showers will start to break apart. We'll see that clearing overnight and as we get towards tomorrow morning, starting off dry, cooler with those winds mainly out of the north. Those temperatures, many of us starting off in the 40s tomorrow morning and then we will only bounce back into the upper 60s, sorry, about 70 for tomorrow afternoon. So certainly a noticeable difference in terms of the temperatures over the course of the next 24 hours. Again, all thanks to that cold front and then as we get towards your Friday, those temperatures will be bouncing back low to mid 70s for those high temperatures for the end of the week. So again, highs today into the low 80s for much of the area. Not quite as warm tomorrow as we'll see those high temperatures in the upper 60s to low 70s for much of the region. And as we look ahead over the course of the next several days, we're talking Friday and for the holiday weekend. Friday is looking great. Saturday, we have the rain showers down towards our south trying to push their way in, but it looks like those do remain farther south. It looks like overnight Saturday night into early Sundays when we start to notice some more of those showers starting to push in. And those showers will be spotty not only Sunday, but also into Memorial Day Monday. But right now, I do want to toss it over to Brittany Ward, who is live from Sterling, Virginia at the Live Golf DC. Now, how's it looking out there right now? What can people expect through the day today and tomorrow? Yeah, Jackie, you know what? We are starting your day off a little bit chilly out there. So if you are heading out to Trump National Golf Club here in Sterling, maybe bring the jacket, but you could ditch the jacket as we head into the afternoon. Take a look at your golf forecast. Today is the official tee off for the Live Golf Tournament. Uh, and that's going to be happening throughout the entire week. Heading into your Wednesday, we finally see those temperatures warm up as they are going to be mainly in the 80s, but it's going to be comfortable out there. We'll have that mixture of sun and clouds throughout the entire day today and then come tonight, mild night as lows are dipping down into the 50s. Now by Thursday, we're talking about a little bit cooler temperatures. Those winds will be on the breezier side as highs will be struggling to get out of the lower 70s. But hey, at least we got a little bit more sunshine to go around for your Thursday. Now, Jackie, the main question is, will that sunshine be sticking around? Well, it looks like for the end of the week, yes, we'll see those high temperatures mid 70s under mainly sun filled skies. However, for this upcoming weekend, we will be seeing some partly cloudy skies Saturday chance for those showers moving in later on at night. So the bulk of our Saturday is dry. It's looking a little bit better in comparison to the models of what we we're showing yesterday or even the day before. Now Sunday looking like some spotty showers and along with Memorial Day on Monday as well as that system meanders its way closer towards our area. We're low 80s on Tuesday. Still a chance for a few showers in the forecast as well. Tosin, how are those roadways looking out there right now? Oh, uh, there's trouble.